Hi, it's Dr. Sarah Larson, and I'm so excited to talk to you about the tool that has helped so many of the clients that come in for medical intuitive work and for guidance. This tool is called forgiveness, or how to forgive. When we wish that we had been different or that a situation had been different, that wish puts us in a powerless place. When we're wishing that a situation wasn't the way it occurred, we are actually negating our own personal power and negating compassion in the experience for ourselves and for the other. Compassion truly is a compass. When we were five years old, we love, learned to love in a particular way. We loved our dolls. We loved, I did, we loved our pets. When we turned 15, we loved even more our pets and we loved the people around us. By the time you're my age and doing the work I'm doing, you love so deeply and intensely. You can look back at the situations back then and feel and laugh about the things that caused you pain. And compassion really is fresh eyes to see things. It's a compass to your authentic, most loving self. Your compass to the part of you that's already free and knows truly about the deepest layers of your capacity to love. It's a compass to your own passion and it's a compass to an ability that naturally lives inside of you that you may have forgotten about. When you truly forgive, it's about remembering who you truly are and resetting your compass to maybe the 90-year-old version of yourself that looks back and experiences that incidents as, wow, they were truly doing the best they could, or I was truly doing the best I could at that time. So every time you say, I am willing to forgive, or actively call in a higher power within yourself or outside yourself to show you the situation or to see it with eyes that give that incident, how you were, a purpose, you are truly moving into the direction of a new internal compass that's already there, but deeply grounded in your ability to love. And it is truly, passion is fire. You have to put yourself a little bit into the energy of burning for the desire for what it gives you. Every time you think of an incident that caused you harm, if you say to yourself, I was doing the best I could, they were doing the best they could, if they could have been different, they would have, and I'm willing to forgive. And eventually that will turn into I do forgive and you will love yourself more for having compassion for burning up the old and being and moving powerfully into the now. Thank you so much.